We're going to demonstrate the Haas Laser Technologies Beam Analyzer Camera. So in this setup, we have a helium neon laser to demonstrate the principles of the device. And the first thing we have to do is align it. Basically, we just make sure that the height at the laser is matched at a distance. So here we go about 9.7 millimeters and over here we're at the right level. So now how we're going to direct the light into the camera is a dove prism where the first surface reflection of the dove prism is anti-reflection coated so we get about a percent of uh, the laser light into the camera. So get this aligned. So we're going through the center of the dove prism there and out the center over here. So now we're ready to direct the camera or the light into the camera. So we've got our light coming out of the dove prism, the first surface reflection off the first face. I have it roughly centered going into the camera. And now we will start the software. To actually get the camera to start recording, we push the play button. And it's going to go through some auto gain adjust. So now that we see this is the full sensor, and here we have a zoom of the sensor, we can see a 2D profile as well as a variety of beam profile characteristics here. The ellipsicity of the beam, second moment, knife edge, full with half max, and Gaussian. We can add or subtract some of these parameters by this drop-down menu. I'll just leave what's here. There's many number of ISO parameters. Once we've got a measurement, uh, we can make an image statistic report by pushing this button here. And from this, we've got all the basic data for the beam profile, which can be saved as a PDF file for later use. As well, one can log all the different ISO parameters for the beam profile by pushing the start button here. And you can have it run for any length of time. And then it can be saved to a, uh, a file that's comma separator the value for importing into an Excel spreadsheet. So a very simple software to use. You can see your beam, its profile. You can get a surface plot a zoom in of the um, 2D plot. Now, if one is trying to maintain a certain quality control in the laser or the laser process, we have upper and lower limits of all the different parameters of the ISO specifications that you can set the upper and lower limits. So each time you see a red, that means it's out of the range of the specification. So here we can see the Gaussian variance is fluctuating a little bit. So we're right on the edge of that range that's been set here. So this is how you can utilize this software to control a process, whether it's a material processing, machining process, or simply characterizations of lasers. So as you can see, the BA cam is a very easy to use beam profile camera. And one advantage to our camera is that we've got the quality control settings so that one can utilize this camera to either apply quality control to the profiling of lasers or a material processing application. <music>